Hey people! So the lighting sucks a little bit because I moved the light back to the little table that it sits on. So excuse the lighting. But I did want to, sh I took you all I was about to do a little book review. And this is the book that I will review. It's called Sisters and Husbands by Connie Brisco. And it says it's, uh, she's a New York Times bestselling author of Sisters and Lovers. So this is a sequel to that book, Sisters and Lovers, which I've never read. But I wish I had it. I purchased this book from the dollar store. You all may have seen this in one of my hauls. I'm not I don't actually know. I didn't get to show the, the books that I got when I bought this. But this book I really enjoy am enjoying this book. I am I think it was chapter six. I'm on page forty one and I think chapter six. Yep, just like just barely into chapter six so this book is about a lady who the day before she was supposed to get married she called the wedding off and she um they were like at the hotel and everything the day before the night before the wedding and she decided that she could no longer she no longer wanted to marry him which she kind of has a history of doing that calling off weddings so this is just about her and her two sisters and her two sisters are already married so it kind of talks about their relationships and I'm not going to give too much away just because I don't really like uh, I don't like when people give away stuff to me but I'll just kind of briefly tell you one of her sisters their, her marriage seems like it's a really good marriage and uh, well actually both of her sisters seem to be having good marriages and in the book you'll realize you'll learn that their marriages aren't all that they seem to be so and that's not why well I don't know if that's why she broke up with them yet because it starts in the future and then it goes back to kind of tell you like what led up to that point so um this is a good book. I would recommend it and I cannot wait to finish reading it. I just don't have the time to read as much as I would like because of me being in school and doing my practicum and you know, working full time. But I recommend you go pick this up and as I always say you can try your local Dollar Tree, the library, or if you really want to read it one of the local bookstores in your area. And it's once again Sisters and Husbands by Connie Briscoe. So if you all do happen to pick this book up, let me know what you think about it. Thanks. Bye.